Welcome everybody to country. How are you? Today we'll solve the exam of statics session one in this year 2023. Look at question number one, show the correct answer. In the other figure, a body of wheat 18 newton is placed on a row horizontal plane. Two fourths of F1, F2 acted on it in two opposite directions F1, F2. If the coefficient of statics diffraction between the body and the plane is 2 over 3, the value of F1 which make the body about to move in its direction equals space Newton. We want relation between F1 and F2. The result would be little b. Look at the steps with me here. First, we know F1 will be equal F2 plus the statics statics here 2 over 3 multiplication by r Look at here we have the body we have here f1 and the weight 18 and we have here r and f2 this is in a row horizontal then we have here f of statics then f1 will be equal f2 plus f of statics okay and r equal 18 and we know f of statics equal mu statics multiplication bar r the coefficient here give us equal to over 3 multiplication by r equal f of f force of statics put here in this relation f1 will be equal f2 plus f of statics here 2 over 3 r and then cancel r and write 18 then f1 equal f2 plus 2 over 3 multiplication by 18 then f1 would be equal f2 plus 18 divided by 3 equals 6 2 times 6 equal 12 then f1 equal f2 plus 12 let be question number 2 in the opposite figure a body of weight w newton is placed on a row horizontal plane a horizontal forces of magnitude f acts on it and make it power to move if the resolution reaction equal to f newton then the measure bit of uh, the angle of static friction between the body and the placed equal and the plane equal space look at here we have here the body and the weight down and up reaction or and here if forces and left hand side f of s we know left hand side equal right hand side and up equal down here then we know f of statics equal mu s times r and we have r equal weight then we can cancel r and write with it f here equal f of the text then forces equal f sticks equal mu of sticks multiplication by r then f equal mu of sticks multiplication by weight and he give us in this example the resolution reaction equal to f he give us r dash equal to f in this example and we know r dash equals square root of f statics power 2 plus r power 2 then we can cancel r dash and write 2f here and give us r dash equal to f and f statics give us equal 
f then we can cancel f statics here and write mu statics multiplication by weight then we can write mu statics times weight here plus r power to r equal weight then we can cancel here and write cancel f is 6 power 2 and write mu 6 power 2 weight power 2 plus r power 2 r equal weight okay 8 power 2 then we can write here 2f equal square root of mu set x power 2 times weight power 2 plus weight power 2 we can write weight outside here and the mu set x power 2 it's meaning 10 theta power 2 plus 1 we know 10 power 2 theta plus 1 it's meaning what it's meaning sec power 2 then 2f will be equal weight multiplication by sec theta and we can cancel f here and write f statics equal mu s times weight cancel this and write 2 multiplication by f m statics multiplication by weight okay i write this here cancel f and write mu statics times weight equal weight multiplication by sec theta and we can cancel them weight by weight here cancel weight by weight then to multiplication mu statics it's meaning 10 theta equal 6 theta here it's meaning 1 over cosine theta and 10 theta equal sine over cosine we can cancel cosine by cosine here then 2 sine theta equal 1 then sine theta equal half then sine theta equal half then theta will be equal 30 degree understood then the result would be letter c question 3 in the opposite figure in the force of magnitude 5 root 2 act on thread line whose slope negative 1 and path through the point negative 1 and 0 then the algebraic measure of moment 2 of the force about the original point equals piece moment unit okay first we have here forces equal 5 root 2 act on the direction of AB act on the direction of direction of straight line EB give us this information in the example okay and we have point E equal negative 1 and 0 and point B here equal 0 and y in the straight line here okay zero and y and the slope we give slope it gives the slope here equal negative one we can find the slope between two points here we have point a and point e. we can find the equation of straight line here y minus zero over x minus minus 1 it will be positive 1 equal the slope equal negative 1 over 1 y will be what y and the x equal 0 here then y will be equal negative 1 in this point will be 0 and negative 1 and this point negative 1 and 0 Okay, or you can find the direction or he give us slope equal negative 1 we can write negative 1 
and one here this is direction and we have the force equal 5 root 2 we can find the vector of force it's act in the direction EP over magnitude about EB times the absolute value of the force F then the force or you can using direction R1 and negative 1 or OMB this is the equality okay because he give us the slope equal negative 1 then the vector R equal 1 and the negative 1 we can write 1 and negative 1 you can use in this method or this method as you like okay you can find the equation of straight line here and then find the point P or you can find the R here the force will be 1 right Make vector R over magnitude about vector R multiplication by magnitude about the force you can use this rule or this rule as you like okay okay uh, over square root about 1 or power 2 equal 1 plus negative 1 power 2 equal 1 multiplication magnitude about the force they give us the force 5 root 2 5 root 2 1 plus 1 equal 2 you can cancel root 2 by root 2 then direction about the force it will be 5 and negative 5 and then we can find m dot it will be the act on a b z it will be o a direction cross the force okay o a here it will be a subtract by o it will be negative 1 and 0 cross the force 5 and negative 5 okay then the moment of the force about the original point it will be OA vector OA cross vector F we can find the result product about extreme subtract means extremes here negative 5 times negative 1 it will be 5 subtract 5 times 0 equals 0 the result will be 5 5 moment unit okay so in this example we can solve it by two method first we can find the equation of straight line EB here and then find vector EB over absolute value about vector EB or you know the slope equal negative 1 then the vector R will be equal 1 and negative 1 because uh, R equal here X and Y and the, the slope equal negative 1 over 1 it's equality negative 1 and then using this rule forces you must convert from the force about the result to the vector by right vector r over magnitude about vector r multiplication by vector of f here you as vector of f equal 5 root 2 multiplication by 1 and negative 1 square root about 1 power 2 plus negative 1 power 2 and then we can find the moment of uh, the original point here the moment of the force about the original point it will be o a cross the force of direction a about f in direction about vector f here okay result will be five five momentum unit good show for in the other figure e b o e b o is a thin fine lamina with the uniform thickness and density in form of triangle of the triangle line CD here whose equation y equal 8 is part 8 lines and o p equal 12 centimeter intersected the a b and the b o at c and d where p O equal 12 centimeters in this part equal 4 then the center of gravity remaining part here okay look at here we have triangle here right angle triangle here a 
one straight line here cut with them in this triangle we will have symmetry we have symmetry between the small triangle and greater triangle here this is part 4 and 8 and it 9 we can find the length here 4 over 8 here or 4 over 8 plus 4 of this length it will be equal this part DC over 9 then DC will be equal 4 times 9 30 tech 30 tech divided by 12 equal 3 centimeters in part 3 centimeter and we have here is a mass of proportional with the area equality so then we can find the area of a small triangle here B C D B C D this triangle and triangle B A O triangle B C D symmetry about this triangle B C D and B A O this triangle B A O okay we can find the ratio between area of one and area of two area of triangle one and area of triangle number two triangle number one and triangle number two we can have right here three over nine all power two it will be the ratio between them one over nine 3 divided by 3 1 when 9 divided by 3 quad 3 it will be power 2 equal 9 then we can write first triangle here the first triangle here the smallest okay we can eat 3 plus 0 plus 0 equal 3 divided by 3 it will be 1 and 8 plus 12 plus 8 equal 28 28 over 3 and center to about the greatest triangle here 0 plus 12 will be 12 divided by 3 it will be 4 and 9 plus 0 plus 0, 9 divided by 3 equal 3 and then draw the table here combining between the weight about 1 we can cancel ratio 1 and 9 will be negative 1 and 9 and the multiplication by k and the k because we have the mass proportional with the area okay and x and y x and y here it will be 1 about first 1 and 28 over 3 and center 2 3 and 4 and we can find x multiplication by 1 times negative k it will be negative k 3 times 9 equal 27 over sum of them 9k plus negative k equal 8k then the result will be what k here again 3 times 9 equal 27 here 27k subtract k equal 26k over 8k cancel k by k divided by 2 it will uh, be 13 over 4 and y negative k times 28 over 3 it will be negative 28 over 3k plus 3 times or k times 9k it will be 9k sum of them equal 8k then the result you can cancel k by k by k and the result will be 10 over 3 in the center here the center of gravity of remaining part will be 13 over 4 and 10 over 3 let us see question 5 is of the figure EB is non-uniform root of wheat Newton okay so wheat Newton Rest on two support at C and D of reaction at the point C equal half the reaction at the point D. Then the ratio between C, D and O, D equal space to base. Okay, we know the road is in uh, equilibrium. It's meaning the sum of sum of momentum of all forces about any point equal zero. 
then momentum of any point equals zero we know this properties okay then we have here of r here and here was r or this drawing r and here of r c point d and c and the weight here we know up equal down sum of r plus of r equal weight and 3 over 2 r equal weight it's relation so the distance between c what is this point c d and this point p okay understood c d this point o okay o and this point v okay then how far times this part then we know how far why we do it because momentum about any point equals zero we can find the point about this point o or d okay how r times this part o c equal r multiplication this part p o we can cancel r by r then o c will be twice p o okay You want to find the ratio between CO and OD. CO and OD is point D. It's point D. Okay. D. Understood here. Again, have R times OC equal R times DO. We can cancel R by R, then OC equal twice to E. DO. Then the ratio between CO to OD, CO to do e, DO, it will be 2 to 1. The ratio would be 2 to 1. Understood? EB is a is E and B here. This is P. Okay, okay. This E and this B. Understood here? E and B. And this point O, look at here, and C and D. And C and D. The reaction of C have the reaction at the point D. The reaction at D have the reaction of C. Then the momentum about the point O equal zero. Then R plus half R equal weight. And we can write weight equal C over 2R. And then momentum about the point O equal zero because the sum of momentum of all forces about any point equals zero we must know this rule because the root is in equilibrium then the sum of the momentum of all forces about any point equals zero we choose this point we write momentum about this point equals zero then half r times oc equal r times do and then we can simplify it cancel r by r here and write the issue between co and OD it will be 2 and 1 Question 6 EB is a non-uniform wooden of wood of weight 100 kg weight Okay And the length 2 meter or length PE equal 2 meter rest on support at C where EC equal 4 meter and give us EC equal 4 meter this part and attach it by a light string from B. A man of weight 80 kilogram weight move the road until reach a point which two points the midpoint of the distance between support and the point action of weight. If the tension in a straight half pressure of support and the road equal brown horizontally, this word equal brown horizontally hertz momentum will be equal to zero about any point. Uh, then the distance between the man and the point of action of weight equals p centimeter. Okay, I will draw here. Let's draw here. E. This point E here. And this point C here. We have reaction here. R. This uh, 
will be 25 centimeter 4 centimeter 25 centimeter okay 4 centimeter equal 25 centimeter this part and we have here someone stand here this part equality about this part I will put here L and L and here with 80 and this with about 100 100 kilogram weight and this point B we have here tension here the root is well burn such as that we know the root is equal brown what's the meaning about equal equal brown the meaning r will be equal zero then r plus t well 80 plus 1 equal 180 okay and he give us this information t equal half r he tell us in this example t half of r put t here then half r here plus right here half r plus r equal 180 3, 3 over 2 r equal 180 then r equal 3 to, uh, 2 times 180 divided by 3 equal 120 then t will be equal 60 because t equal half of r understood we know this length equal 2 meter so this part will be equal one uh, 200 subtract 25 equal 175 centimeter this part from a to b equal 2 meter which means 200 centimeter subtract 25 centimeter equal uh, 175 centimeters this part okay then we can find the momentum about the point choose the point what the point c we can find the momentum about point equal zero because the root is equal to momentum about this point we can cancel this reaction here because momentum about the point c equals zero then we can find 80 here the sweet drawing here the reaction here zero and the direction about 80 inverse the clock so it will be positive times l etl and 100 multiplication by l plus l equal to l and we have t here give us t equals 60 i will find t equals 60 here 60 kilogram weight reaction here in this direction with clock it will be negative 60 times this lens 175 times 175 the result will be equal zero then we can sample the state 80 plus 200 it will be 280 l and it will be moving here 60 times 175 it will be 10,500 then L equal uh, 37 and half centimeter. Question 7 in the opposite figure ABC is aware with uniform thickness and density AB equal BC equal 80 centimeter. This angle equal 120 degree. Then the coordinate of the center of gravity after a pint equal space. Okay. We know. If we draw this coordinate here, 0 and 0 is point, this angle 120 degree and this angle will be 60, I will draw here, triangle, about the center here, because the center in the median, about the point, line segment here, P and C, it will be 40 because the length here equal 80 this length equal 40 centimeter and this angle 30 then the length here will be 20 then the order about this point equal what negative uh, 20 and 0 
and this point moving negative vert 20 and going up here 20 root 3 because we have 30 skc triangle it will be 20 uh, root 3 here in this point here a it's quality and this part quality is part okay okay you can find the mass proportional with the lens here to find the mm, coordinate of the center of gravity it's been to what we can find that they draw the table and write order about anyone here and using the dividing we can using the dividing about uh, two bars here and center of gravity we know here this point equal uh, 20 and 0 and the point negative 20 and 0 and the center will be what we know m1 here act at the point here negative this point negative uh, 20 and uh, 20 root 3 negative 20 and 20 root 3 is this point okay and this point act in 20 and 0 but this here 40 yeah yeah it's the length 80 centimeter 80 centimeters this length 8 centimeters this uh, will be 40 and 0 look at here we have this part 80 centimeter and here it's centimeter and the center here and center here we want to find the center about gravity about it bit wire we can find or draw the table here do the table and write the width and x and y about the first point and second point here the first point here we give the order here it will be 40 and 0 and the width it will be 80 to 80 it will be 1 to 1 because the ratio between two widths equals the ratio between two lengths one on one right k and k and center about the first the first pc here we call talk about pc here and b e center about this point here 40 and 0 right 40 and 0 and center here equal negative 20 and negative 20 and 20 root 3 okay and then you can find x here 40 times k it will be 40k negative 20k over some of them equal 2k 40 minus 20 20 divided by 2 equal 10 the result will be 10 and y equal 0 times k equal 0 20 root 3 times k over k plus k equal 2k then y will be equal 20 divided by 2 equal 10 10 root 3 so the center will be 10 and 10 root 3 the coordinate of the center of gravity after it bent it will be 10 and 10 root 3 understood again okay i will explain it again we have here triangle c p and this point uh, I will put it L. Okay, anyway, this lens here 80. This point will be what will be 40 and 0. It's order here, and the order here will be moved. We have here 120 degrees this angle, and it will be 30, it will be 30 degree and 60. Uh, this part will be half of lens here. This lens was 80 and this part will be 40 and then will be 20 but this point it will be negative 20 and 0 moving negative 20 and up here 20 root 3 this point negative 20 point e and the momentum of force about the original point equal 24 in direction i subtract 8 in direction k where if parallel to y axis then f equals space okay he give us f uh, parallel to y axis forces parallel to y axis 
then we can let uh, the force f equal b in direction j okay then momentum about point o it will be oe cross force f we can write here i and j and k o a it will be a subtract by o one two and three and the force here will be zero zero and b and zero right zero and b and zero because it tell us if parallel to y axis okay then we can find the result here and the result will be what zero he give us the result here equal 21 in direction i 24 24 in direction i and negative a in direction k i j k j zero and negative 8 in direction k we can find the result here choose uh, 24 here equality the first cancel the row and the horizontal 3b negative 3b equal 24 cancel row and horizontal it will be 0 subtract 3b equal 24 then b equal negative 6 negative 8 24 divided by 3 equal 8 then the force here equal negative 8 in direction j Question nine. In the opposite figure, EB is a root with uh, negative weight is equal gram under the action to couples 40 40 and F and F kilogram. If then C equal 4 over 3 and EC equal 4 centimeters, then F equal space kilometer. We know F1 plus F2 equals 0 to M1. Magnitude 1 plus magnitude 2 equals 0 because it tells us is equal gram. Well, wrong it's meaning momentum one plus momentum two equals zero. Okay, he give us ten theta. Give us ten theta equal four over three. Then length will be equal five. We have to cobble here uh, F and F. Force here and force here we can draw here it's theta. It will be equal this uh, theta degree and it will be 9 subtract by theta here or it will be draw or you can draw here this line here it will be equality theta equal theta here because it's parallel to this lens perpendicular okay we can find uh, momentum 1 and momentum 2 here momentum one drawing here in direction inverse about the clock it will be f here times the lines here between z the lens here equal this lens give us uh, ac equal four centimeters this four centimeter so it will be force multiplication by sine theta right force and sine theta the momentum one equal f times the force sine theta equal four over three over uh, five you can see this this then one over five f it's momentum one and momentum two about couple here 40 and here 40 as distance between them one and force meter we can find the direction here negative 40 multiplication 1 and 4 it will be negative 40 times 1 times 4 equal 4 plus 1 equal 5 it will be negative 50 so momentum 1 plus momentum 2 equals 0 then we can add momentum 1 here it will be fifth f plus momentum 2 negative 5 50 equals 0 and then we can find f here it will be 50 times 5 equal 250 kilogram weight okay this is the result understood
Question 10. In the opposite figure, the body about uh, to slide under the action weight only. Then the coefficient of static friction equal space. Okay, we have triangle here. And this body, this triangle, uh, the length here 12 meter, and here 13 meter, it will be 5 meter here. The body about the solid under the action of the weight only. Okay. So angle here it will be theta and we can find tan theta equal uh, 5 over 12 the result will be 5 over 12 why because he tell us the body above the side under the action of its weight only it's meaning new statics equal 10 theta equal 5 over 12. Question 11. If the set of forces F1, F2, F3 act as in point A and B and 3 respectively, if the uh, set of forces equivalent to couple within the algebraic measure of its moment equal space, we know the moment of couple equals the moment about any point in the plane. The momentum of the point. C any point choose any point such as that C or original point as you like equal C A cross F1 plus C B cross F2 act is in the point C so we haven't momentum about it or F3 F3 momentum about it equals zero because it's axis in the point C okay and then we can write here the result C A it's meaning is subtract by C cross F1 plus B subtract C act F2 E subtract by C we can find the difference between them he give us in the example A and C here C subtract by A 3 minus 1 equal 2 uh, 1 minus 3 equal uh, negative 2 and 2 minus minus uh, 3 here A e and C, okay. 2 minus minus 1, it will be positive 3. Cross uh, F1, will be 3 and uh, 1. 3 here and 1. Plus B subtract by C, B and C, and 2 minus 3, negative 1. And negative 2, multiplication by F2, 2 and negative 3. We can find the product about extreme subtract by product by means so negative 2 minus 9 here and negative uh, to be positive 3 and here it will be negative 4 so the result will be what it will be here subtract it will be a positive 4 okay negative to negative equal positive 7 5 minus 4 in direction okay. okay the result will be negative 4 question 12 a b c d is a rectangle which a b equal 1 meter b c 5 meter if the fit of force is 100 uh, force is 400 300 400 300 newton we have couple here 300 and 300 and 400 and 400 in the fit of force is equivalent to a couple of the norm of its momentum. It's meaning what? A momentum of couple equal m, m1 plus m2 plus m3. We can factorize this uh, force here. Look at here. This force 300. We can factorize it here. Up and down. Vertical and horizontal. About this force here. Theta and here we can cancel the this 300 it will be 300 cosine theta and this force is 300 sine theta and this angle theta it will be 300 we can factorize it cancel this and factorize uh, 300 sine theta and here 300 
cosine theta okay and we have here 400 act here is this point and 400 act here first we can find the the momentum of carbon equal m1 plus m2 plus m3 we can find 400 moving here right uh, m1 plus m2 plus uh, m3 equal 4 and 4 drawing here the inverse about clock and the distance between them was 2 meter and uh, 300 sine theta 300 theta the length here 5 meter between them 2 plus 3 plus uh, it's moving with uh, direction uh, the clock negative uh, 300 sine theta multiplication the length here 5 and 300 cosine theta here moving this force it will be positive because it's moving with the clock 300 cosine theta multiplication by the length between them 3 we can cancel sine theta from triangle c4 and 3 and 5 sine equal 4 over 5 and cosine equal 3 over 5 uh, 4 times uh, 400 times 2 equal 800 the result will be uh, 1200 and here cancel them equal 60 times 3 times 3 equal 9 6 times uh, 9 it's negative here okay or not the distance between them uh, 300 times 3 over 5 equal what again 300 because I see this part lines 1 sorry this part 1 between uh, was AB equal 1 meter here I don't write here in the drawing AB equal 1 meter okay this 1 meter this 1 meter the lines about A and B it's distance between A and B because we have 30 cosine theta and here 300 cosine theta and here 300 cosine theta these two forces here the distance between them equal 1 meter okay this 1 meter I write uh, here Cosine theta equals over 5, and we can symbolize it will be 183 times KST, and we can symbolize it here. Uh, the result will be 800 subtract by the, some of them, 8, and the result will be what you can write negative here 0 and 0 and 12 minus 8, 12. Plus three, one plus two equal three and write one. The result here eight and thirteen minus eight equal five. The result will be negative five hundred eighty. But he asked about the equivalent the uh, norm norm. It's meaning absolute value about negative five hundred eighty. It will be five hundred eighty. He asked about the norm of its momentum. It will be 580 Newton. In the norm of uh, the momentum of two cable equal 580 Newton meter. Question 13 is the opposite figure. AB is a uniform load of length 120 centimeter of weight 80 kilogram weight raised by its end A on row vertically wall and rest by its end p on row horizontal uh, ground weight of magnitude 40 kilogram weight okay uh, is suspended about point c point c here with the wood where ec equal 20 centimeter is a normal reaction at p equal 50 reaction here kilogram weight and row is about slight and then the coefficient of reaction between load and the ground equal space okay look at here i will draw this example here and we have here action 50 then we have here 
mu static c here because it's rho it's rho here so it's the direction here because it's moving right hand side then we have here mu sticks is a force about sticks here mu x times 50 it will be 50 times mu static c ask it about mu static c you won't find mu static c here in this example you give us here the weight 80 and weight here 40 at the point c here a and this point p okay and the length here equal 120 it will be 60 and it's 60 because the weight act in the midpoint here and give us 20 and this will be 40 okay and reaction about a i don't know it uh, so i can find the reaction about a equals zero because um uh, the root is equal bra then the sum of moments of all forces about any point equal zero you can find the momentum about point e and write the result equal zero I will write here, here look at with me about 50 moving here direction inverse about clock it will be 50 times the length here this length I don't know the length because it's perpendicular and he give us this angle 45 and we have triangle here is theta the length here 120 and this angle 60 45 45 then the result here will be what 120 uh, cosine theta cosine 45 equal 1 uh, over root 2 then the result will be uh, root 2 over 2 multiplication 120 it will be 60 root 2 and then this length equals 60 root 2 and this length 60 root 2 okay then this direct lens all these links equal uh, 60 root 2 right 60 root 2 and this force 80 moving with the clock it will be negative 80 multiplication this lens i can find this lens equality this lens and it was 60 okay and this lens equal what it will be 30 because the 45 and it's 45 it's equality triangle here so this lens equal uh, 30 root 2 this lens equal 30 root 2 understood this lens equal 30 root 2 because this triangle look at here outside it was 60 centimeter then this lens equal 30 root 2 okay I will write 30 root 2 about this lens understood and the power this lens look at this force here 40 negative 40 times this direction look at this direction i want to find this lens it's very easy because we have triangle here it was 20 centimeter and this angle 40 we have corresponding angle 45 45 45 because it's parallel we have three ties parallel here this 20 and this lens will be 10 root 2 multiplication 10 root 2 and magnitude equal zero we can cancel root 2 by root 2 by root 2 and find the result momentum about this point equal 0 uh, and uh, we have here we have uh, another next uh, this force I write, don't write this force I will complete here this force uh, negative 50 magnitude uh, moment, uh, constant here negative 50 multiplication by mu statics times the lens here this lens equal what about greatest triangle the greatest triangle here this lens equal what we have here 120 and this lens equal 60 root 2 and here equality 60 root 2 because we have isosceles triangle multiplication by 60 root 2 understood here 60 root 2 we can answer root 2 by root 2 by root 2 the result will be equal 0 50 times 60 equal right 0 and 0 and negative right 0 and 0 3 times 8 equal 24 
it will be 400 negative right 0 and 0 5 times 6 equal 30 and 0 10 minus x divided by 100 30 minus 24 minus 4 it will be 30 minus uh, 28 minus it will be in negative here 30 mu statics it will be 30 minus 28 equal 8 uh, 2 equal 30 mu statics uh, then mu statics equal 2 over 30 it will be 1 over 15 the third d understood Question 14 is the opposite figure. A, B, C, D, a parallelogram. E, H, bisect angle A. Quality here. Two forces, 5 and 5 gram. Question 14 is the opposite figure. A, B, C, D, a parallelogram. E, H, bisect angle A. Two forces, 5 and 5 kilogram weight. Form a couple quadram with another couple generated by two forces, F, F. A gram weight then you won't find the force equal space gram weight okay look at here this angle 120 this uh, angle will be 120 subtract by subtract from 180 then this, this angle will be equal 60 degree because this parallelogram reverts about uh, parallelogram it's uh, corresponding angle will be supplementary angle okay uh, this uh, line segment here bisect and this line segment bisect this point e b c and d and this point o this angle 120 then this angle equals 30 and 30 because 30 plus 30 equals 60 and it's bisect and it's, it's parallel here direction up here to couple forces here draw F and F. We won't find the lines here perpendicular. We know uh, the two couples are equilibrium. It's meaning uh, momentum one plus uh, momentum two equal zero. Momentum one about forces uh, F and F, and momentum two about forces F and F. Okay, we can find momentum one plus momentum two. Momentum 1 here about 5 and 5. This force uh, down here 5 and 5 moving with uh, the clock, direction about the clock it will be negative, right? 5 and uh, the line you can draw perpendicular here. Okay, this will be 120, it will be 60 and 60 or perpendicular, it will be 90 and it will be 30 because this angle equal 120 understood look at here i will draw outside this point a and b and this angle 90 degree about perpendicular and d and we'll put it will be 2l this lens 2l and this angle equal what we know this angle equals 60 then this angle equal 30 then this length equal L and it will be L root 3 so we can write here momentum 1 equal negative 5 multiplication by the length equal L root 3 it's momentum 1 about force here 5 and 5 where 5 and 5 it's 5 here force 5 and 5 and the lines perpendicular between them equal L multiplication by root 3 and momentum 2 about force F and F this force and this force we want to find this lens it will be L because it's equality 2L divided by 2 equal L and L and this angle equals 30 we know this triangle look at here it's L and it was 30 then this lens will be what will be half L because it's opposite about 30 it will be half L then you can write here of L 
multiplication by the force F and the direction here inverse about it clock to the positive then momentum 1 plus momentum 2 equals 0 so we can eat them and equal the result by 0 here it will be a negative 5 multiplication L multiplication we'll see momentum 1 plus momentum 2 equals 0 we can cancel L by L and find the force it will be half force equal 5 root 3 then the force equal 10 root 3 letter b the result will be letter b question 15 in the opposite figure triangle abc right angle triangle at b and it's part it's space pc okay 6 centimeter and BA equal 8 centimeter. If a force magnitude 24 Newton act as a point C uh, with the vertical and make the work and they make with the vertical angle measure 30 degree, then the algebra algebra measure of its moment about point A equal space. Okay, we want to find what the algebra measurement of its point there is momentum about point is this force we can write the direction ac cross the force but we must convert this force 24 to what to vector it is a value we must convert this force from value to vector by multiplication by 24 about the uh, units vector here from the point C or you can convert this force or uh, factorize this force between look at here it's perpendicular okay perpendicular and we have the force here I will factorize this force 24 factorize it it will be 30 right here 24 cosine 30 and here 24 sine 40 okay understood because it's perpendicular here i will find to the point a and we have point b it was 8 centimeter and 6 centimeter okay understood okay it was perpendicular to this piece okay we have two forces we can find momentum about point a momentum about point a equal 24 this force direction by the clock it will be negative 24 cosine uh, negative 24 cosine theta 30 multiplication by the lens 6 and this force 24 moving by this direction with the clock it will be negative 24 sine theta multiplication by the lens here 8 okay and we can find uh, angle here equal 30 it's 30 and write the result in the simplest form negative 24 cosine 30 cosine 30 equal root 3 over 2 multiplication by 6 negative 24 sine 30 equal half times 8 it will be negative 12 times 6 equal 72 by negative and here 4 times 24 4 times 4 equals 16 2 times 4 8 plus 1 equal 9 this is the result negative uh, 96 subtract by 72 multiplication by root 3 Question 16 is the opposite figure 3D coordinate system here force is F and ABCO is right and right uh, trapezium AO parallel to BC the force if X on EH direction if magnitude about force F equal 13 kilogram weight then the momentum of uh, force F about the point C 12 and negative 5 and 0 equal not we want to find the momentum about point c we want to find uh, the direction 
look at here momentum about the point C we must uh, find the force hertz act about the point E this force C act the point E and we want to find momentum about C we can find direction about C E cross the force okay but uh, in this example he give us uh, force value we want to convert it to direction we know the vector of f equal it's the act on a and the direction e h we can write e h vector e h over magnitude about e h cross the value about force then f equal e h equal h subtract by e this point e direction here equal what 0 and 10 and 0 and point E equal 0 and 0 and 24 can find the distance between them a h equal h minus 8 will be 0 and uh, 0 minus 10 equal negative 10 24 minus 0 equal 24 multiplication by forces give us the forces magnitude about it 13 uh, over square root 100 plus 24 power 2 it will be square root about it equal 26 times 13 equal half half times this uh, uh, vector e h equal 0 and negative uh, 5 and 12 divided by 2 because you can cancel them the result will be half half times this force equals 0 and negative 5 and 12 okay and we know force acts in the point a we can find magnitude about c a c a is meaning is subtract by c and we need here c order about c equal 12 and negative 5 and 0 then the vector c a equal vector a subtract vector c vector a 0 minus 12 it will be minus 12 10 minus minus 5 equal uh, positive 15 0 minus 0 equal 0 and then uh, we can find uh, magnetic about c about this rule c a cross vector f right here i and j and k c a equal negative 12 and 15 and 0 and the force f force f equal here the force equal 0 and the negative 5 and 12 you can find the result the result would be 180 in direction i plus 144 in direction j plus 60 in direction k letter e question 17 if the set of Coplanar parallel forces F1, F2, F3 acts in three points ABC, respectively, in the moment vector momentum or moment uh, vector of their resolution about point D equal is we to find momentum about point D. Uh, we can find he can give us in the example point D. So we can find the uh, DA cross uh, the force one because force one acts in the point A plus. Uh, d b acts in the point b cross f2 plus uh, four three here mm, d c acts in the point c about four th three you can find d h meaning a subtract by d and force one two and negative three plus d b b minus d b here subtract my minus d it will be what 3 and 4 subtract force f if you do here equal negative 6 and 9 and 9 uh, and dc c subtract by d c subtract by d negative 3 minus minus 1 equal negative 3 plus 1 equal negative 2 and here negative 6 cross by 4 3 equal 6 and negative 9 you can find the result by product by extremes plus the means it will be negative 6 here minus 4 and here 27 plus uh, 24 ok 
okay it's result okay here it will be positive 18 plus 36 mm, negative 6 plus uh, 4 negative 4 it will be negative 10 at here 4 plus 7 11 3 plus 2 equal 5 6 plus 8 equal 14 4 plus 4 equal 5 it will be it will be subtracted by 10 but it will be 95 in direction k understood because uh, we want to find the momentum vector of the resolution at our point d we can find the direction distance between point d and a and the force f1 because force one act in the point d or the point a and f2 uh, act in the point b and f3 act in the point c we want to find to the point d okay to the point d will be da cross force f1 and db cross f2 and dc cross f3 understood question 18 a body of weight kilogram it's placed on the row including the plane link it to the horizontal with theta angle if the magnitude of the force acting in the body uh, in the direction gets the slope upward and make it a power to move upward to weight to sine theta kilogram it's direction about the weight here find the magnitude of the reaction reaction equal space okay reaction here r dash won't find r dash in this example we have uh, the weight here and the force equal to weight sine theta it's the force at this to the body here and it's so oh, we have here weight we can factorize weight here with cosine theta and here with sine theta and we have here forces about statics here then to weight sine theta will be equal if statics plus weight sine theta okay okay and we have here reaction equal weight complication by cosine theta this is what it's the reaction we can find here or equal weight cosine theta and we know uh, fs it's meaning mu statics multiplication by reaction and we would find r dash okay we know r dash equal we know the rule here about square root about this body look at here this body and here action and the r dash here and we draw here fs so r dash it's r dash equal r dash square r dash square equal from uh, fisa or serion this hypotenuse here equal fs fs power 2 plus r power 2 then r power 2 r dash power 2 uh, you can write square root about f s square plus r power 2 then r dash equal square root about f s here we can cancel forces moving here to result or to sample state we can sample this to find f s here we know f s here in this example force about statics moving here it will moving here to the left hand side it will be with sine theta we can write here with sine theta with power 2 sine theta power 2 plus r power 2 and r equal with cosine theta right weight right r here cancel r and right weight power 2 cosine power 2 theta okay and we can sample it to find the result r dash equal with outside and sine bar 2 plus cosine bar 2 equal 1 then r dash equal with
understood in this example you want to find the resolution reaction magnitude of the resolution reaction equal weight we use the rule here r dash equals square root about f statics power 2 plus r power 2 right if i was this information 2 weight times sine theta equal force is about statics plus weight sine theta we can find f statics here it will be weight sine theta and r reaction equal weight cosine theta we write it here in this example about the relation about the reaction here resolution about action resolution action and reaction and the result will be letter c question 19 if two forces f1 f2 acts in two point a and b respectively if uh, result resultant of two forces at point c where c point a b find the coordinate of point b want to find the coordinate about the point b we have f1 acts on the point a and f2 acts in the point b uh, the resolution act is uh, at the point c so the two forces are parallel and they uh, move some direction look at here i will draw here we have f1 and f2 f1 and f2 f1 here this force f1 act is uh, in the point f1 can it, uh, 6 and 4 acts in the point a1 and 2 and uh, f2 acts in the point uh, the order here 3 and 2 direction f2 acts in the point b x and y i don't know it we know uh, the ratio between f1 to f2 we know f1 twice f2 so the force will going to the greatest the r about them the greatest force it will be 3 plus 6 equal 9 and 2 plus 4 equal 6 it's act in the point d but it's coming to the nearest to a because it's the greatest force one greatest than the greatest okay greater than f2 it's f1 the order about this direction 6 and 4 and the ratio between them f1 f2 what we do f1 twice f2 it will be 2 to 1 so we can write here 1 and 2 write the inverse about the direction here 1 and 2 you can find this point here that's x right 2 equal 1 times x it will be x plus 2 times 2 equal 2 over some of them equal 3 then 3 times 2 equals 6 equal x plus 2 z x equal 4 and write y here 1 equal 2 times 2 equal 4 1 times y over 3 then 3 times 1 equal 3 equal 4 plus y then y equal negative 1 then the point b order about it 4 and the negative 1 question 20 in the other figure ab is a firm road length 120 ab of weight 125 newton hang it from its end a by hang vertical wall and just on one of its point c here on the smooth vertical support smooth uh, such uh, that ch equal 20 centimeter and ed ed equal 80 equal dh equal 80 centimeter find the magnitude of reaction of support on the case of equal bar okay we will draw here and this is like this draw b and c and a and it was d and we have here the weight 135 it's h 20 centimeter bc and this is 80 centimeter the weight here the quality is equal to this 80 centimeter centimeter the rate is the equilibrium then the sum of momentum of all forces uh, about any point equals zero 
we can find momentum about the point A choose this point the moment about this point equals zero we can choose the point here with 135 multiplication by the width here length uh, 100 what we can write uh, this length and this length uh, this length equal 80 centimeter it's equality 8 centimeter like it and 80 and it's 80 and this length equals 60 centimeter okay 80 centimeter and they give us these lines uh, equal 120 and it was 20 and it uh, 100 centimeter 160 and 80 okay okay we can choose uh, the reaction about this point or multiplication by the lens 100 so it's moving here with uh, the clock it will be negative r multiplication by 100 and then we have here 135 or 125 sorry 125 he give us the weight here 125 moving uh, inverse both direction 125 multiplication the lines here if we draw this line segment and it it will be equality this lens i want to find this lens to multiplication by it this angle will be 100 centimeters then this lens equal 40 centimeter this lens 40 centimeter and it's 60 centimeter okay and it's perpendicular about this side we want to find the lens here we know this part equal 20 centimeter if we put it, it will be l1 and the lens here equal 80 it's lens 80 centimeter we can find the ratio between l1 and 80 you can write symmetry between the small triangle here and the greatest triangle l1 over 80 equal 40 over the lens here 100 understood i will find the lens here l1 to find this part 80 subtract by L1 understood I will find the symmetry between the small triangle here and the greatest triangle L divided by 80 equal 40 divided by 100 then L1 equal what we can simplest it 4 times 8 equal uh, 4 times 8 equal 24 uh, 32 so this part equal 32 then 80 minus 32 equal 48 then length will be 48 and the momentum about the point a we know equal zero then we can find r by multiplication by them over 100 125 times 48 over 100 then r equal 60 understood you know uh, I get the lens hell by symmetry because it tell us uh, AB a uniform root lens 120 this lens equal 120 and this part equal 20 and this part equal 100 and the width here act in the median 60 and 60 60 equal 20 plus 40 this lens equal 40 okay this part equal 40 and 60 and then you can find l1 and the end find 42 okay my students understood okay this is the end of question about the exam goodbye with my best wishes goodbye